Howdy guys, it's Ethan. Uh, I've learned a ton over the past couple of days about how this works, about making videos and recording and getting my thoughts organized. Uh, and that was great, but those are the weekends. During the week, uh, especially Mondays, I've got a lot going on, but I'm still committed to posting every single day this year. So, uh, instead, Mondays are going to be smaller episodes. I think I'll have to decide what to call them later because I kind of came up with this idea on the fly. But that said, Mondays are going to be specific pieces of content that I'm going to review and talk about. The one for today is a poem. I originally heard this on a podcast called The Art of Charm. Uh, there's a little bit more written about it on my blog, so you guys can go check that out at uh, runerevolution.com. And uh, the website here says it's by someone named Peter Dale Wimbro Sr., and it's called The Man in the Glass. When you get what you want in your struggle for self, and the world makes you king for a day, just go to the mirror and look at yourself and see what that man has to say. For it isn't your father or mother or wife whose judgment upon you must pass. The fellow whose verdict counts most in your life is the one staring back from the glass. He's the fellow to please, never mind all the rest, for he's with you clear to the end, and you've passed your most difficult, dangerous test if the man in the glass is your friend. You may fool the whole world down the pathway of years and get pats on the back as you pass, but your final reward will be heartache and tears if you've cheated the man in the glass. Uh, it's... It's powerful stuff. Uh, it's got a lot of gravity to it. Uh, if you go and look at it yourself and read it, it's pretty evident what it's talking about. Uh, I believe everything that's said in here wholeheartedly. If you aren't at peace with yourself, if you haven't learned to accept your failures and grow as a person, no matter what you've done, uh, then you'll never be truly happy. Anyways, guys, uh, this has been the first uh, mini-episode Monday. I, I know there's a lot of, uh, lot of people out there who, who use the term mini-sode or mini-episode. I'll figure out something to call this in the future. Um, but that, that poem has been written on a whiteboard in my room for the past several months since I've heard it. And I plan to keep it up there for a, much long, for a, for a very long time. It means a lot to me because it means a lot to me because for a long time I was just worried about pleasing other people and at the end of the day study if you study the people who are the most successful they are at peace with themselves if you can be at peace with yourself that's when you can start changing the world changing the world starts by changing yourself guys thanks for watching Really appreciate it. Like, comment, subscribe, share, whatever. Uh, thanks so much, guys. Bye.